Shia We're watching this now. Is an artist. Yeah. Welcome to his museum. He brought you such works as watching all of his movies in a theater back to back and wearing a paper bag. Do it. Make your dreams come true. But now he's ready to unveil his magnum opus. He will not divide us. He won't divide us. Their message from Astoria, Queens, broadcast for the world to see. Camera feed will be up 24 hours a day for at least four years. The media called it a triumph. The first great art. Where is that from? He will not divide us. Like, why are people saying that? It's from the Trump pro. Oh, it's from the. Okay, okay, okay. Sorry. I thought she has said it. Of the Trump era. He will not divide us. He will not. But unfortunately or, for Sean, whatever Paul appreciates she, uh, Shea. I don't, dude, how do you say his name? Shea? I don't, dude, I don't know how to fucking say his name, dude. But you're so <laughs> Shia. 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 I don't know how to say his but name, dude. I slapped the chicken tendies out of her hand. Paul had one goal in mind, to take over the exhibit and trigger Shia. Thought I say Shia, dude, it's Shia. <laughs> That's so stupid, man. By day two, Shire is getting sick of hearing about Pepe. Pepe! He will not divide us! Pizza Gate is real! Shia LaBeouf is a rich white liberal who doesn't what care does that about the working what? class. Clearly Six hours later. Is that a little speaker? Whose speaker is that? Paul learned that Shire was particularly triggered by Nazi role playing, so it became a game to make Nazi references while he was on camera. What is he doing? Like, he set up a camera and he just goes there every day? It's art? He lost his goddamn mind and called it art. All right, okay, all right, all right, okay. All right, okay. Praise Keck. What's up? Bang bang. Hitler did nothing wrong. In a what? Oh, dude. Rage. He sexually assaulted some dude. Then Sam Hyde showed up. But it all came tumbling down. Off camera, because of a misunderstanding, he assaulted one of his own supporters. The police caught the event, and he was arrested. He was deported back to Los Angeles the next day. Soon after, hey, Cryo, they thank also you for had the to put up a fence. Thanks, man. A wall, if you will. And now only five people at a time can come in, and they are very well vetted. But credit where it's due. Although this was not good art, Shai had created one of the most fascinating things to watch on the internet. And here are a few of the best featured characters. The Milky Bar Pimp. You know that's hate speech. Hate speech. Hate speech. Yes, towards black people. The Milky Bar Pimp? Dude, I have not heard of any of this shit. 
subliminal racist type of things they do. They try to say that um, like black people are lactose intolerant. Like just purposely drink milk outside very obnoxiously. How'd you get my phone number? How'd you get my phone number? I haven't given out my phone number. Did you hear that? At the end he said Hitler did nothing wrong. There's so many racist people calling me right now. AIDS Bjorn. 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 I, I, I don't use I don't use the word Nazi lightly. Nazi, 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 Nazi. Make America fight Nazis again. I love you and I love these people. Fuck off, Nazi. People started chanting "Son, calling him that cock." Yo, joyful. Thank you for the thank you for the race. Son. My, my son. The guy is standing right behind you. The child, the pedophile. What's your name? Brittany Venti. I came there to trigger people, and it was great. <laughs> But there are many, many more. It is the single best reality TV show on the internet right now, and it is going on for the next four to eight years. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. But there are many, many more. It is the single best reality TV show on the internet right now, and it is going on for the next four to eight years. This is still going on? Oh, okay. Is that a little speaker? Has changed. <laughs> it's an endless series of proxy battles fought by mercenaries and machines. Dude, that was such a good game, man. Metal Gear Solid inside their bodies oh, so good. and regulate their ability. After defeat on the battlefields of New York and New Mexico, Shire headed to a new hidden location. No more chanting or interaction. This latest exhibit would just be a flag waving arrogantly in front of a camera. You didn't there like were no it. landmarks. I love no scenery. It. No clues at all floor. to its it whereabouts. So it would be impossible to find, and nothing could stop the like broadcast. The Metal Gear Solid a Check lot, yeah. mate. <laughs> and this would allow Shire to act smug for the next four to eight years. That is, unless Pol's agents could find a way to track it down. Challenge accepted. It was to be the greatest game of Capture the Flag ever. Pol began organizing. They set about gathering all the information they could on the local environment, trying to match up cloud, wind patterns, and ambient noise. Because it was a live stream, they could match the time of sunset to quickly discern that the flag was somewhere in the eastern time zone. Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, dudes. Okay, alright guys, I'm gonna be real. The Channel 5 thing and this thing right here is blowing my fucking mind, alright? We watched the first video and it was like a picture book. It was very easy to follow, it was funny, you know, it was all that. And then, and then all of this shit, I have to use my brain, I have to think about it. This is fucking hard right now for me, man. Please have some patience, alright? I'm very, I'm very slow right now. I'm hungry, the cereal wasn't enough, my brain isn't functioning. Okay. Shia set up a camera and he just walked in front of it and talked and said, like, he will not divide us. So far, I'm correct. Okay. The basic concept of that is all it was, right? And that is considered, like, art. And then, because it's so ridiculous, People came in and started fucking with them, right? So then they were like, wow, a camera. Yeah, I'm gonna go up and do something stupid. Okay, so then he started to get pissed off. He was trying to do something serious and people were like memeing on it. I just need to make sure that I understand this video correctly. And now they're putting up a random flag and someone's trying to take the flag down? Okay, yeah, and when he puts up the flag, he live streams the flag. Shia put up the flag thinking no one could find it. Man, I'm too old for this shit, dude. <laughs> I'm too old for this shit, man. That's two-thirds of the country ruled out in one move. Others began looking into intel about Shia's whereabouts, as it was highly likely that he was present for the raising of the flag itself. As time went on, distinct noises could be heard in the background, the croaking... And this is 4chan, checked, but you can hear frogs, so it's probably near a body of water. People are like this bored with their fucking lives? This is, this is blowing me away. 
Holy fuck. King of frogs, suggesting water nearby. Then, the second big break, in the distance, just faintly, two jet streams. Paul quickly opened a live feed of all of the air tra traffic across the eastern seaboard. But identifying these two lines, amongst all of this, would be a challenge. Meanwhile, social media trackers found this post. At a small town diner in Tennessee, this waitress couldn't help but brag about her run-in with Shire. It was another big break. TMZ also reported that Shire had been Yo, seen DTM, fly thank fishing you for the in resub. the area. Are the new sub? Yo, welcome in to the channel, man. Welcome to the Tennessee. channel. The hunt was moving much faster now. According to the aviation team, two more planes would soon be flying overhead. If they could be spotted on the live stream, Paul would have confirmation. Bingo. To further narrow down the search area, the aviation team started charting all of the flight paths of spotted planes. But they still needed more information. And as day turned to night, they got it. Paul's astronomy division used the constellations hey, to narrow down the, the angle the and song. rough position of the camera. With this, the flight paths, and some advanced trigonometry, the candidate area had been reduced way down. Further confirmation from weather satellites backed up the claim as an agent was dispatched to the scene. As he drew close, he started honking the horn, while viewers of the live stream gave feedback as it got louder. A few minutes... <laughs> oh my, like, dude, holy fuck. I would never in my... It would never even enter my mind to do anything like this. It's later, target sighted. But he couldn't just head in during broad daylight and risk Shire's wrath. Instead, he had to wait for the cloak of night. In the meanwhile, Paul got to work devising an infiltration strategy. A few hours later, the flag came down, and a MAGA hat and shirt went up. It was a beautiful moment, and it all took place on the live stream. Paul's central intelligence. So, they found the flag. Oh my god. Intelligence agency had clocked Windu season three in 38 <laughs> hours and 14 minutes, and poor Shire was divided for a third time. Yo, how pissed was Could he? Could he ever recover? Could this be the end? Yo, zombie, thanks for the sub. Thanks for well, as I was editing this video, there has been an update. The stream has gone down in the MAGA hat and shirt with it, but Intel indicates that the flag will be up again soon. A drone was flown over the area, and you can see here that Shire is keeping guard of the flag. Whoa, 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 what did that say? Soon. A drone was flown. Shia is staying at the house farm and is guarding the flag with a baseball bat. This was taken from drone footage. Over the area, and you can see here that Shia is keeping guard of the flagless pole. In response, Operation Eagle Eye is on standby. The drone carries a sophisticated device. You can see here a MAGA hat. <laughs> Dude. Oh my god. Confederate flag and bucket to find out what will happen next. Stay tuned for season four. There's another video, right? There's another video, right? Season 4 is here, and this okay. time it's at the Fact Museum in Liverpool. Okay, three, two, one, it's Finding it wouldn't be hard, the live feed stated where the flag was. The challenge would be breaking in and taking it. Within the hour, scouts were doing recon. Okay, I'm, I'm sorry dudes, I'm sorry. I have another question. Why do we care so much about him raising a flag that says he will not divide us? Do we care so much because he cares so much?
It's about sending a message. Okay, all right. I was not prepared for today's React stream. I'm going to be real with you guys. I thought we were just going to watch some, you know, picture books and, and laugh at farting and queefing. Okay, I didn't know we were going to have to think. Okay. Hundreds of sleeper agents on pole were activated. The planning began. Plan A. Walk in the front door, take the lift up to the roof, and steal the flag. No good. Guards already disabled access to the third and fourth floor. Meanwhile, an agent stakes out the cafeteria. They learn about the museum's private security and that they're on 30 minute rotations, checking all corridors and emergency exits. Plan B, scale the building. Here's the fact museum. Okay, all right. So they already know the location of the next flag and it's in a building. So now they have to find out how to get in the building. The building is super secure. All right. The flag, ladder access to the platform, 24 hour CCTV, doors to the roof and entrances to fact and adjacent buildings. The route is simple. Walk into the neighboring complex, gain access to the roof, across, jump over a four meter gap, sneak by the CCTV and work around to the flag. Meanwhile, online, Shia and his friends were- I've informed the security inside to be on the lookout for intruders looking to steal the flag on the roof. So Shia literally paid for all this to happen? The staff inside told me that they are already aware of possible intruders and or breaking and entering. Just to be safe, I've emailed two. Uh, he would do nothing wrong. Uh, threads, so, okay. Again, fuck you all. I hope each and every single one of you d What the f- We're reading 4chan, ready to call <clears throat> the cops if they got onto the roof. So Discord teams ran counter intel posting fake news updates to the public forums. Plan C. Another team was experimenting with a high wattage laser to burn the flag from a distance. <laughs> Obviously that didn't work. <laughs> a side quest, Operation Shadowlay, involved a Bluetooth speaker packaged in bubble wrap, which would then be lobbed onto the roof. But five stories up proved to be too far to throw. Next, Plan D, as well as E and F, all involved drones. One agent worked on a flamethrower assembly. Another worked on a weed whacker attachment to cut down the flag. And another would simply attach a can of paint and drop it on the camera feed itself. While these three were busy fine-tuning their new sex robots, the propaganda department was hard at work on MS Paint drafting artwork to rally the troops. Plan G, trust-based infiltration. All of a sudden, fact inboxes were flooded with unsolicited resumes for internships and janitorial positions. Maybe soon they couldn't trust their own employees. Curators of the museum were getting spooked. Already that day, they had caught someone trying to make their way onto the roof using a fake press pass. But while plans A through G were all being debated over, three people with no plan at all were scaling the building. They discovered that the flagpole mechanism was locked in place with zip ties, and they hadn't brought scissors. They were almost immediately seen on the roof. Ooh, yo, you gotta have scissors for zip ties. Oh God. Security was triggered and the police were dispatched. The three agents fled without getting the flag. But they managed to cause quite a scene. Police did a sweep, however, no one was arrested. But it was still mission accomplished. Fact abandoned the project. The flag and live stream were taken down. Liverpool's closed. Wait, so they didn't get the flag, but they made the live stream go down? Oh yeah, the museum got tired of this shit. Okay, yeah. Okay, at this point, it is well beyond any type of message. Like, make America great again, the he will not divide us. None of that has mattered for quite some time. The only thing that matters is Shia's putting up a flag and we got to take it down. That's it. That's the only, it does, like that flag could literally say anything. It doesn't fucking matter. The only thing that matters is that flag is going down. Okay, all right, all right. Okay, okay. <clears throat> 25 hours. 
another record. But this isn't the end of Shire. No, the Season 5 DLC, Hwindu Cabin Fever, is almost ready. And I don't see any footsteps. Spooky, huh? And then right beside it is this huge tree that's obviously come down recently. Tree? Do it! <laughs> Time for a quick recap. Season 1, New York, Shire's arrested. Shut it down. Season 2, New Mexico, someone pulled a gun. Shut it down. Fine then, we'll do a shitty flag. Stolen. Season 4, another flag, but with guards. Stolen. I'm going to sit in a cabin for a month and do nothing. Mission accomplished. And that brings us to now. The flag is back. Stationary camera, completely muted audio, no confirmed clues, just a white flag on a white wall. Time to get to work. So, shut. Oh my god, dude. Camera, completely muted audio, no confirmed clues, just a white flag on a white wall. Time All right, so he put the white flag on the white wall and he set up a stream? This is him trying to tell the internet, find it now, bitch. Okay, all right, all right. Time to get to work. Okay. So Shia won't be making a cameo this season. He has bigger concerns. Which is why his buddy, Luke Turner, featured here in season five, has taken over. So it goes live at 4 p.m. GMT. The first thing to determine is the source of this light. Is it a lamp? Or natural? Well, it's moving very slowly and its luminosity is changing. That means there's a window. The angle of the light means the window should be about... Oh my god, dude. Imagine if we put any of this work into, I don't know, like anything positive, how much better everything would be. Here, with the camera here, so the relative positions of things in the room should be like this. Next, they wait for sunset. Sunset is 8 p.m. GMT. Okay, that puts the flag somewhere in this zone. Oh my god. Does Lord. Luke have a house in this area? Yes, he does. Perfect. Yo, is Time Daniel, to do thank some recon. The, thank you for the sub. As it thank gets darker, it would be easier to see a light flashing through the window. Location confirmed. Three hours, 58 minutes. So what now? Some people tried to fuck with the Wi-Fi router. Mm, whoa, no whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. That puts the flag somewhere in this zone. Does Luke have a house in this area? Yes, he does. Perfect. Time to do some recon. As it gets darker, it would be easier to see a light flashing through the window. Location confirmed. Three hours, 58 minutes. So... <laughs> what? Bruh. What now? Some people tried to fuck with the Wi-Fi router. Mm, no good. And then... Nothing, really. I mean, look at this. What's the bloody point? This is no better than uploading a still image and declaring victory. Especially for art. It's boring. Now this. This was creating discussion. It was arguably the greatest reality TV show of the last decade. But instead we have... 
this. So. <laughs> this is going to be a new thing. Sleep on the stream with a webcam so people can poke their virtual fingers at your cheeks. So we're waiting. Same and flag. Waiting. And we're waiting. Until. Holy shit, there's a fly on the flag. People flocked back to the stream. Holy shit, dude, yo, that's bonkers. <laughs> a fly on the flag, dude? <laughs> Let's go. The flag itself made for a makeshift Ouija board. What was he communicating? What clues could this fly provide? D? D. D. Hey. High definition. Why? What does it mean? Of course. People like to watch television in high definition, particularly when there's a football game or Game of Thrones or something. And when that happens, often people order food in so that they don't have to miss anything. The most common kind of delivered food is pizza. That's it. Send the house dozens of pizzas. Oh. Alright. They did this. Let me just say, they did this. And they shouldn't have. Because it's... Come on. It's not funny. I mean, it's a little bit funny, but it's... It's not right. You animals. Animals do that kind of thing. Don't do that. Thank you. Look. As I'm making this video, nothing really has happened outside of tracking down the flag. No one has taken it. There have been plans to. Plans to give it an upgrade. But there's a good chance that nothing will happen. That the stream will be like this for the next three and a half to seven and a half years. But, after five long seasons, the only way he can say he will not divide us is by locking himself and the flag away from the world. But I suppose there's a bigger question here to be asked. If a man protests with a flag, but no one tunes in to see it, did the protest ever really happen? It was the show that should have ended seasons ago. A man, perhaps undivided, but almost certainly alone. Alpha don't want to be open myself anymore. Is this stream still up? It's not. Oh, <laughs> <laughs>